We're heading down the road of extinction. Here we are in Caroline County, Virginia, going to the northernmost pitcher plant bog in Virginia, down to two plants. This site has declined from 10 plants in 1990 to two plants in 2010. There used to be 10 pitcher plants in here. We found the site in 1990, there were 10 pitcher plants, and the colony stayed at that number for quite a while. Then about five years ago, the, the colony started to crash, and that was because the habitat, if you look around, the hardwood trees were closing the canopy. Even the sub canopy was closing the vegetation. So two years ago, we intervened and we started clearing vegetation here. When we did that, there were four plants when we did the intervention. In that year, we lost two plants. We literally saw them die. They had been infected by fungus and rotted off before our eyes. We were literally witnessing the process of extinction. However, the two plants that were still here, by removing just a few stems, allowed enough light in, it's, they started to flower. Last year we got one flower. This year, because of our efforts, we now have three blooms on one plant and a single bloom on this plant. So what you're seeing here is a work of art that's in great need of restoration. And just like a painting, that sat in an attic uh, or somewhere and has been covered with grime. This is going to take a lot of work to restore, but, but it can be done. That's one of the exciting things of preventing extinction. You can intervene, stop the process, and reverse it and restore this to a beautiful sphagnum bog. We have the opportunity to actually buy the five acres that contains the pitcher plants. Is five acres enough? Uh, the answer is no, but we already have a plan to address some of the other issues. Immediately upstream of the haul tract uh, is the Gatewood tract. And we've had a conservation buyer come out of Richmond, a retired botany professor, that is, is in the process of buying that parcel. And that's going to protect the headwater of the pitcher plant bog. And that was a necessary first step before we can embark on protecting that site. We want to make sure we protected the headwater, which we're largely going to achieve. And now we can proceed with the preservation of the haul pitcher plants.